Circus number four. Suck my PP pee -pee or get banned. I initially wrote a script about the mods as well, but after video recording it, I felt insanely stupid wasting my time with such petty and pathetic nonsense. And as such, I deleted it. Because honestly, I'm aware that the degenerates on Art Arcade didn't like me, and that I was disrupting their echo chamber, so screw it, they probably wanted their piece. However, I got into a discussion on Discord, and it became clear that the mod is full of shit. Now first things first, this is my personal message to you, Radical Southside. Fam, I don't care if you're sorry or not, you lied to your friends about this case. First it was a long, long, long time ago, and you couldn't even remember about this. Then you didn't see the quotation marks at all, despite quoting the quotation marks. Then you didn't read my post at all, despite me having evidence that you reacted to me on multiple occasions. And afterwards, it was about a ban wave, and I just got hit. You're trying to save face, and it is really pathetic. Just have some balls and say that you abused your powers because you were butthurt about me. I'm not gonna share more than what I already did here, but keep in mind that I have your Discord discussion with IU saved, so even if you want to bullshit your way out, make sure that I'm not seeing it. And before people go apeshit crazy on this particular mod, this is quite common on Reddit. I had a similar case on the Syrian Civil War subreddit where I got a permaban because my account was not old enough. However, they were not braindead enough to block communication with me or threaten me with muting, just because I tried to solve this matter like a mature man. And plot twist, it even got solved. On our Turkey, you're not even allowed to do that. You have similar questionable mods all over Reddit, including the European subreddit, where, in my humble opinion, mods are even worse. Here's a simple graph showing you the hierarchy of humanity. The scum is gathered on 4chan, just gets diluted to Reddit and then to the rest of the world. If you're interested, don't. If you even think about creating an account on 4chan, burn your PC and throw it out of the window in this very order. Now what should we take out of this? For the radical south side, hopefully you understand that this shit is absolutely cringe and that you're promoting a racist echo chamber on Reddit. Like dude, what do you think people are going to act and behave like when you act like an ape? As a moderator, you have a responsibility in setting the tone for the rest of the sub and your behavior is setting the bar as low as possible. Even if I was a radical Islamist, which is by the way an accusation these degenerates on our Turkey kept repeating until other degenerates started believing without questioning, this does not justify banning me without rule violations. For the rest of us normies that are not of the superior 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 sperm of reddit mod sperm with their mcdonalds crowns and their massive egos, roses are red, violets are blue, moderating on our turkey is exclusive and their behavior abusive. Shocking, who would have thought that? But the main take should be that the behavior on our turkey is the direct responsibility of the moderating team which a is too small a number to stop the flood of degeneracy, in which case they are still responsible for not expanding their moderating team, and b, which is still their responsibility because some of the members of the moderating team are degenerates themselves. Now I could finish this topic here, but there is one last star guest which absolutely takes the show and who is in the background like a cowardly snake showing himself like an angel. It is of course Woozle1337, this dude came to youtube to wrote this comment. Stop the video and read it yourself, it's also on the first video of the series, I'm not gonna read it, but I want to get into some of the claims he's making here. This is such a gigantic circus. First, guys, you have to understand, this man is working so hard, which is why he can't click on the links I linked in the video description and remove the degenerate comments. This is such a hard task, it might take up to 5 minutes. What do you think this man is? A moderator on reddit? Oh wait, yes he is. Fam, you're such a shit show with such claims, either you can do your mcdonalds job properly or you expand the moderating team, you can't just not expand it, play the victim and write such nonsense. The fact that you didn't remove any of the degenerate comments I showed in the series shows how little you care about the subreddit, you don't give a shit about it. It's not hard to retroactively remove comments and posts and of all the people, especially you should know about this since you deleted the evidence, which I will come at the end. Second, you're such a coward covering yourself up. If you have so little time to moderate the subreddit, then why are you partaking in discussions? Why are you escalating a simple comment into a discussion about secularism? If moderating the subreddit is so important to you, then why are you insulting other users here? Saying you're delusional is setting a good tone for the sub? Third, 
You're accusing me of racism without waiting for my video series to end while allowing racist posts and comments, while you're yourself discriminating against religious people and going absolutely crazy about Muslims praying in the Hagia Sophia. You're massively butthurt about Muslims. Are you sure I have to be the one that has to think about who is racist here? Fourth, you banned me for this, you perma banned me because I said, quote, as if anyone will go, I didn't really believe much in religion, but now that I can freely enter Hagia Sophia, I am a dedicated Muslim. Allah Akbar, kill the infidel. So by your very own logic, if I say Boozle1337 never said, I'm a racist, so go and kill all Muslims, in this very manner, I'm violating the subreddit's rules. I already know that the other mods agreed that this is very wrong, so how about you come out and take statement to this? And don't pretend that you know nothing about this. You yourself replied to me and claimed that the context doesn't matter. This is such a clown show. Don't even try to talk to me, Mr. Ronald McDonald. You know, I'm a very busy man. My video is a reply to you already. And you know what? You might flood the comment section or my mail. So refrain yourself from writing to me, please. Else I will have to get you muted. <laughs> no, 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 no.